Lee? That you? Shit. I thought you were... gone. Listen. Need to find Evelyn. I really don't want to... Talk about her. You know where she is? What I just say. Drop it. I won't tell you again. Can we meet? Let's meet, please. You at Lizzie's? seen you here before got a good memory for faces bars closed sorry you need to talk to punch and Judy she in her den yep take the stairs down I'll let Judy know you're coming Nothing to see back Let here. Let it lie. Judy's friend. You done with that bagulio? Yep. Stop telling every joy toy you meet to come here. The hell I'm supposed to do with them all? I don't. Must be our rep. Girls need help, they come here. Last time I checked, we weren't running a shelter. Come on, they all deserve a chance. Any one could end up useful. Give it some time. They'll pay for themselves. Pay? Chicks can barely take care of themselves. Not when they're face down in the mud. But who knows? Could surprise you. I hate surprises. Mm-hmm. Really feeling that sense of community right now. Sus, we're not done here. Oh yeah, we fucking are. You just don't give up, do you? Listen, have you seen Evelyn? Need to talk to her. It's important. Why? So you can make her your scapegoat for your train wreck of a heist? Seem to know how the heist went. Meaning you did talk to her. I know how you fucked up. Got all your Doombas killed like a real pro. Caught some lead myself, too. Boo-hoo. Occupational hazard for you, Mercs. 
You do this for fun, talking around in circles. I'm trying to make this simple. Just tell me where she is. Why can't you? I don't trust you. That's simple. Sure, I took a risk. We all did. But it was Evelyn who gave it to us in the first place. She knew what this was from the start. Fine. Looks like we're all in this piss pot together. But you're desperate. Writing's on your face. Excuse me? I came here with a simple question. You're the one making me desperate if I am. Maybe instead of judging, you could just tell me where she is. All right, enough. Get lost. You care so much. Find Clouds. Look there. And where's Clouds? Sig case on my desk's got the address. Just take it and go. Mega Tower. Luxurious. What's Clouds? A dollhouse. But can't say I like your chances if you don't know that much. Read the streets. Evelyn's there. You know this. Or are you guessing? Saw it in the tarot. Now ghost before I call the girls. Hold on, a dollhouse? Evelyn a regular there? Or a drone? Club's closed. Don't you have somewhere to be? Forget Evelyn. Admit it. This is about Judy's virtues, isn't clock, it? Hun. Good shit, if I say so myself. They call me Mr. Hands. If you're looking for Pacifica jobs, call me. Name's V. And what? No pleased to meet you? Hm. I'm truly honored to meet you. You got any biz? Call me. Kaku Okada, the Lady of Westbrook Estate. When you find a moment, come see me. We must settle our accounts for Sandra Dorset. You did quite well, you and that friend of yours. Until then. Discount yesterday. Half price on everything. And I sold twice more stock than usual. 
So Call me Mr. Hands. If you're looking for Pacifica jobs, call me. Name's V. And what? No, pleased to meet you? Hmm. I'm truly honored to meet you. You got any biz? Call me. Kaku Okada, the Lady of Westbrook Estate. When you find a moment, come see me. We must settle our accounts for Sandra Dorset. You did quite well, you and that friend of yours. Until then. The way I see it, only thing waiting for you here is getting off or getting off. Place your bets. What have I missed this time? Enlighten me. Brain dance chick is hiding something. No coincidence we already saw two tiger claws. They must control the building. Thanks to their Suze Lake 2 hibernation implants, the miners were able to survive without access to food and fresh water for two weeks. Fortunately, Let's get out of here. And following a brief rest for technical evaluation, the miners were able to return to work. Moving from below the earth to above it,
Welcome to Clouds, where we know what you're looking for. Would you care to jack into the terminal? So how's this all work? An algorithm pilots the doll's motor functions. It takes your profile data and transforms into experiences in real time. Memory dampers on the doll's behavioral chip block any recall of the session. So there'll be no trace of the meeting? Well, I could say yes, but that would strip it of mystery and suspense, wouldn't it? Once you're in there, you set the stakes. You're saying it's not dangerous, but there's some risk involved. That is one way to put it. One thing is for sure. You never get what you expect. Consider my interest peaked. All right, let's do this. This will be a live session, so events may take an unexpected turn. But don't quit if you feel uncomfortable. You could miss out on something truly remarkable. If you feel unready to handle what comes next, you can interrupt the session immediately. Now for your safe word. Afterlife. And saved. Now, bear with me a moment. Scanning your personal profile. You should see compatible dolls in just a second. Two matches. Interesting. Is that normal, or...? Who can say what is normal? You're clearly a unique person with... unique tastes. Our system can handle it. So who will it be? Angel or Sky? Looking for Evelyn Parker. Does she work here? Hmm... Give me a moment. Evelyn's not available at this time. Need to see her. It's important. The algorithm knows best. Trust me, it will choose a doll that will thrill you. Our dolls can change their hair and eye color in real time to look just as you wish. I'm not a customer. Well, all the more reason to be excited then. There's a first time for everyone at Clouds. Don't dawdle. Huh. <sighs> I'm sorry, did she finally say anything useful? Fuck the menu, let's ditch this waitress and take our special order to the chef, point blank. So who will it be, Angel or Sky? Meaning? Meaning you go in as a customer, keep a low profile, rather go with Sky. Keep their cards close, I couldn't have we'll chosen better myself. Game. Now for the payment, and you'll venture into the clouds. There you go. And the payments come through. The entire floor is open to you if you wish to wind down first. Sky awaits you in booth nine. Disconnect, please. Is that it? <clears throat> we have a strict no weapons policy here at Clouds. Please deposit any and all hazardous items with me. Only two willing Thank to spread you. their legs for we you. We hope you enjoy your Sad. stay. Sad. Go eat a dick, Johnny. Not bad, but it would be much better here. I can't get in? What's that mean? I'm here every motherfucking week! You're not authorized to access the VIP area. Oh, yes, I am! No, sir, you're not. You can take it up with the manager. No, dog! I'm taking it up with you! Here, now! You got any idea who I am? This conk don't understand that I've got a right to be in there! From what I can see, your VIP membership has been revoked. Say what now? Please stay calm, sir. Or we're gonna have to escort you outside. 
At least I would hear no laments about pain. It hurt. It's a hologram. Guess that makes you a real deviant. Would have had more choices if I didn't have a certain brain parasite. Hi, I'm Sky. And you must be Vincent. V. Just V. Only people who know me real well can use my real name. Okay then. V. Welp, looks like this'll be interesting. So, V. You're dying. And any for your well, thoughts. There was someone named Evelyn Parker. Used to work here. Know her? Know where she is? You need answers. That's clear. Just not the ones you think you need. I asked you a simple question. Evelyn Parker. Not the most important thing you're looking for, is she? I can smell your fear. You're afraid of something else. Afterlife. Oh, what's going on? Goddamn thing threw me out. Need to talk to you. Talk? You pulled the emergency brake, ripped me out just to talk? What happened? I do something wrong? Evelyn Parker, what do you know about her? Not much. Everyone's got their own booths, their own problems, their own little bubbles. It's a fragile ecosystem. People like you barge in, violate it, try to rearrange. No. You gotta help me. Please. I'm no threat, but she could be in trouble. Just want to talk to her, find out if she's okay. In case you haven't noticed, doll work's not the most secure job in the world. One day you're in, the next you're out, and maybe gone. Anything out of the ordinary happened here lately? Fine. Heard a customer did a number on her. But that's all I know. Shit like that happens around here way more often than anybody'd care to admit. You ought to ask Tom. Two of them were inseparable, gossiping for hours on end. A washing machine has a motor. Who's Tom? A doll, like the rest of us. What do you think? An XBD star? Where will I find him? VIP area. Booth 2, I think. Thanks. See? You turn out to be useful after all. Second floor is for VIP customers only.
What were you really think they remember nothing? Anything. Well, that's Whatever the whole stands point. to fuck They're me up the quickest. Not a Are they? More like. You better keep this short and sweet. Two brainwashed sex zombies in a single day is too much, even for me. Hi. Um, I think something might have gone wrong here. Not really sure. Uh, I don't have your details. Sorry, no idea what I'm supposed to do. I need to get in touch with Evelyn Parker. It's important. You and me both. Tried calling her a bunch of times. No luck. You mean to say she's not here? She had an accident. Needed to go to a special clinic in Osaka. Or Oslo. I think it was Oslo. For a new faceplate. Tell you herself she was skipping town? Nah, just didn't show up for work. Wasn't picking up either, so I asked Woodman what was up. Told me she left, like I said. Woodman, who is he? Mr. Forrest, but everybody calls him Woodman. Never really known why. Okay, Mr. Forrest then. What's his thing? He's kind of like our caretaker. Finds new talent. Deals with ugly situations. Got it. Could it be Woodman finally shed some light on this shit show? Man can only dream. The skull sponges in these dolls. So why every time do they restart the conversation where we left off? That's not remembering? Have you ever heard of Jotaro Shobo? He's one of the T-Claws. Yeah, I've heard. A fucking psycho. Likes to hurt people. The Looks familiar. What's that? Evelyn's jacket. It's crumpled like a tissue. He must have been here a while. Assos like Shobo have been on my blacklist before I heard of him. Hold it there, honey. You seem to be in the wrong place. Hey, no peeking. Bad luck. Tiger Claw's moonlight is peeping Tom's. They always got eyes in their dolls. Know what goes on in these boots. Then, data mine the behavioral chips. Saw that twist coming a mile away. Had a hunch. Still, wonder if it's for their own use or for sale. And who'd be buying?
Left her purse. Could have had more than one. All the shit's in it, though. Must have left in a hurry. No clients allowed in here. Be a chum and close the door on your way out, would you? As you can see, I'm very busy. Looking for a girl named Evelyn Parker. Got nobody working here by that name. But she used to. What happened to her? Probably did what all the dolls try to do. Found a unicorn to set her up for life. Ah, you could do better. Try Roxy over a booth too. Same heart-shaped ass. Behavioral chip will do the rest. Won't feel any difference. They call you Woodman, right? That because you have as much charisma as a tree stump? Somehow, I doubt you understand the situation. Situation? Right? What situation? Think I give a cat's turd about every limp dick who walks through here? Look, we can settle this without anyone getting hurt. Why make this any harder than it needs to be? Should ask yourself that. Listen carefully. One way or another, I'm gonna find her. And when I do, all kinds of shit is gonna happen. Shit, you don't want to end up on the wrong side of. Assume you believe your side to be the right one. Take a wild guess. All right, fine. I'll lay it on you straight. Girl you're looking for, Parker? She ain't here. Tell me something I don't know. Like, where is she? Think you know how things work around here. But you don't know shit. Dolls aren't here to give you pleasure and satisfaction out of the goodness of their soul. They're workers. Their job's to generate profit. Is this you talking it out straight? What happened to Evelyn? Got an order from up high to recycle her. You killed her? No. I found a ripper doc who was willing to take a look. Yeah, said he knew something or other. You invested your own eddies to help poor, unprofitable Evelyn. Please. <laughs> You got me. Ripper's the one who paid me. You took her to the Ripper instead of following orders. <laughs> Didn't take you for someone with balls. For fuck's sake, I'm not running a slaughterhouse here. I only recycle as a last resort. And family always gets a call. If there is any. Think there are any daddies out there willing to change the diapers of a brain-dead little slut on the verge of cyberpsychosis? Probably not. Casting him out on the street ain't an option either. Can't risk tanking our crit. People like you deserve a special place in hell. Eh, people like you need to come up with better insults. We done here. The Ripper. Name and address. Don't know a last name. Don't fuck with me. I'm not. Goes by fingers. Clinic's in some godforsaken alley up on Jig Jig Street. Wanna find Evelyn? 
Look there. And don't come back here. Ever. While you're at it, take the elevator. Quicker you're out of here, the better. Doc Fingers on Jig Jig Street. Sounds like a co-ed's wet dream. You may take your weapons. A pleasant day to you. So how's this all The next all time work? you have that er An algorithm pilots the doll's motor functions. It takes your profile data and transforms into... Experiences in real time. Memory dampers on the doll's behavioral chip block any recall of the session. So there'll be no trace of the meeting. Well, I could say yes, but that would strip it of mystery and suspense, wouldn't it? Once you're in there, you set the stakes. You're saying it's not dangerous, but there's some risk involved. That is one way to put it. One thing is for sure. So hold on. Got to my interest in this place. In that slimy, subterranean kind of way. That's infidelity. Uh, no. See, your opinion about dollhouses hasn't changed. Oh, but it has. Dollhouse ass. Before, I wouldn't have touched one with a ten-mile pole. Now I'm thinking a fire'd really make this place shine. No feeling going on, no thinking, no awareness. It's empty. Might as well be late. Nicola! Taste the love! You had a plan, you tried, it fell flat. Now you're flat. Don't look in any condition to find Hellman. Ah, oh, fuck! What the hell's that? No, no, damn it! Jesus! What the fuck do you want from me? It's all going too slow. Gonna decommission before we learn how to rip the chip out. Yeah, let me alone. To sell yourself to the Sakas? They'll end you. One Plain as dead. that. Said so yourself. Made it pretty clear since that I changed my mind. Want you to live now. Can't find the words to describe exactly how fucked up you are. I just needed a calmer moment to think. And yeah, figured since fate gave me another shot, I'll take it. To live life to the fullest? See the northern lights? Run with the mech bulls or with gazelles on a safari? To finish what I started, I'm back in the game. Want Sokka out. So I'm gonna need you in. But why? Fighting for some dated ideal? Pursuing a personal vendetta? You don't need to know. Here to get me from point A to point B. Listen, I know things. Where we can save your life. Who can help us do that? You'll get rid of the chip. I'll smash Sokka. Win-win, kid. Soul killer's what we need. And Makoshi's how we grab it. Okay, so... This Makoshi, what is it exactly? Okay, basics. If you're jacked in, cruising the net, Arasaka can use Soul Killer, an AI, to trap, fry, and pack away your psyche, your mind, and your soul. Following so far? Sure. That's how you became a construct. Exactly. Now, Mikoshi's the place Soul Killer operates out of. 
where it stores its victims' engrams. Come on, come on. You got more to say, so just say it. Fifty years back, ops on the human mind. Makoshi was the sole place on Earth where they did anything like that. Bet it still is today. Telling you, all roads lead there. It's where we'll settle our biz. You yours, me mine. And, uh, how you plan to smash Arasaka this time? Got another nuke tucked away? This time, bombs named Alt Cunningham. I'm supposed to know who that is? Not yet. But you will once we find what we need. For now, we got no time to lose. Need to get inside, Makoshi. send anyone to fix it. Watch your language. Can't you see who you're talking to? Taking me in? Absolutely. That's not nice, is it? Mm. Well, don't you look delicious. So this Come more up your alley than clouds. Here, hey, kid, 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 what's you know the what rush? <laughs> he chipped you for free? Fuck off! Yeah, gear looks a little basic, but it works. B, so can you talk? Money? It is important. Nada? Not even what's dogs? important? I like may I have found a solution to said, the problem we time. share. I have established a contact with an old friend from Arasaka. He's here in Night City now. He's well connected to certain influential people. Hey, you're looking for some... That's gonna help us right? how, exactly? Well, you there will be a you. meeting. You, me, and this friend of mine. You will tell him what you told me. The truth of events at Kompiki Brother. I have little hope that he will be convinced. Got something that will keep you a start. Hours. What this Slow one down. do? Fine. Where's the meat and when? Why do they Japan Town. After sunset. I am sending you the precise location. Yeah. I'll, I'll see, see you there. <clears throat> Got something you that'll keep something. you hard. For hours. Sure. Got some time to kill. Come on, baby! Something that'll keep you hard for hours.
Not one step closer. Here to see who. Look, I don't want any trouble. Just let me through. Pretty please. How about you pretty please me? <laughs> all right, all right. Go on. No, no. Oh, gracious I'd creature! And, and benign! Don't who turn off the light! Visiting to the Summer elements of pure! Us! Who the world in the basement the whole Bloody time. stain! Imbrued! If, if for a friend the king of all we owned, our prayer to him should for thy peace arise! Sounds like paradise. Fingers. Know where I can find them? If I could, I'd swap, you know? Why does everything have to be so damn convoluted? In the end, only I got left to shredded cables and empty bottles. Get it, your skinny ass! You will be when every mox in town descends on this shithole. You got a financial claim? Take it to court. Point. Just pay me what you owe me, and you can fuck off the greener pastures. <laughs> I don't owe you shit. Made it all the way here, huh? Must really want to talk to Evelyn. What? Come on, you pull that. Hello! There's a line! Nuh uh, you ain't cutting. Sit your ass down and wait your turn! Fingers guy, you know? Heard some things, yeah. Like... His hand sometimes slips. What are you even doing here, Judy? Same thing as you. Looking for Evelyn. Mean to say, this whole time you knew Evelyn wasn't at Clouds. Who do you take me for? Why would I lie about something like that? Because you don't trust me. You're right, I don't. But that doesn't make me a liar. Mox don't happen to have fingers in their crosshairs. No, why? Her joy toys come out of his clinic in worse shape than they come in. Yeah, well... 
can't solve all the world's problems at once. We're gonna be here forever. I just know it. Maybe you could talk to those girls, see if we can cut in front? Why me? I don't think they like me. Just give it a shot. That or come up with something better. You worked at Clouds. Not as a doll. Tunes are virtues. That's where I met Ev, Tom, and the rest of the crew. Fingers. Where will I find him? He's operating on somebody right now. Been in there for ages. Shouldn't be much longer. Don't hold your breath. I spent hours waiting for him to come out. Especially when he collects payment right after the procedure. <laughs> I need to talk to him. It's important. You think we're just here to polish our nails, huh? I'll let yeah, you cut in front of me. You're a real pain in my cleat, Mitzi. You know that? And you? Hmm. Might as well knock and find out when he's mopping. Supposed to be a goddamn yeah. clinic. Wait, Not in any of your blonde Go on now. Don't before. you worry about her. Face plates previous Come on, let's go. Longer face than you. Edges are stretching your optic nerves. Don't worry. Your eyes will done. adjust. We're going in. Eventually. Yes? Hello? What can I do for you? Need a minute of your time. A minute? That's all? Shame. Could watch those juicy lips of yours flap for hours, days. <laughs> but I'm busy right now. You tiger claws! As far as I know, I'm all paid up. We're with the Mox. The Mox? Why didn't you say so? So, what brings you here? These girls know your chip and faulty implants. You might say so. I'd say they're the very best I can find. See? What's in it for you? Whatever they have to offer. And they always have something to offer. <laughs> You're a sick fuck. Know that? What do you two want? Heard you help the working girls around here. Well... Very few children will play with broken toys. So when skin goes flabby, sockets go out of whack, implants malfunction... I'm sure you get the gist. You pay for goods, you expect top quality. Consumerism 101. Please. Scrapyards offer better quality than this. Evelyn Parker. I need to know where she is. Step into my office, please. Many girls come through here. So many. But let me put it to you this way. I believe in giving each of them the personal touch. Ask anyone. I'm more than a chop doc. See, I know what people truly want. To be flattered, praised. What about your logs? Gotta have some kind of record. Heck, like this you don't register. Don't put any names down for Blue it. Blue hair, doll chip, best brain dance gear ever, though damaged. Was she here? Poor girl. Tried to help her, I did. But as you can see, this isn't exactly a state-of-the-art facility. You mentioned you couldn't help her. Help her with what exactly? If I only knew, I wager she'd be standing here, happy and smiling. Instruction register on her chip was burnt to a crisp. Tried replacing it. Nothing. Any idea what caused the damage? Tech was top-notch. Didn't go kerplunk on its own, that's for sure. Saying she was targeted? A net runner, as I see it. One with some serious code up their sleeve, too. Get to the point.
The point? Ah, yes. Well, I haven't the faintest idea where she is. Enough of this bullshit! What'd you do to her, you freak? Now, either you put a muzzle on this creature, or put her down. It's impossible to have a conversation with her around. You're scum. Pathetic. A waste of words. I'm a hair away from putting you down. Two beefers from a BD studio took her. Didn't even know their names. They mentioned a moth of all things. Virtues with the death's head. Said she'd be good for the moth. Need air. I'll be outside. I let her go back to clouds. Could have stopped her, but I didn't. Don't worry. We'll find her, I know it. We'll fucking find what's left of her butchered corpse. Hey! Keep it together. You wanna give up now? No. Only lead we got's an XBD. Where's that get us? We also know we're looking for something related to the death's head. It's better than nothing. I don't get your optimism. Still sounds like a big fat nothing to me. Dead said symbol bring anything to mind? Anything. Doesn't matter how small. This industry... I mean, market's looking for every kind of fetish out there. It's cavernous. But an XBD outfit would be on the move almost always. Makes them harder to nab, harder to sting. Need to figure out where they're scrolling this stuff. Gotta be a rat hole of some sort. Doubt they do much shooting on location. Yeah, gotta be somewhere quiet, out of the way. It could be we'll see something to point us in their direction and one of their virtues. Ugh, have to be real gonks to leave a clue. Everyone, everything, leaves something behind. Just need to know where to look. Lucky for me. I'm running around with the best BD specialist in town. Has an extra pair of expert eyes. Well, your BD expert has a better idea. Pleasures of Night City. A domain with its twin on the dark net. Every kind of thing goes on there. Might stumble on something useful. Let me think for a sec. I think I've got a better idea. Saw a smut shop on Jig Jig Street. 
All kinds of stuff there. Think you might find a death's head? I can't hurt to try. Meantime, see if I can't find something on the NCP domain. I'll wait in the van. Blue butter? What the hell are they taking? Blue, huh? Probably a suffect. 24 hours, you feel no pain and barely remember a thing afterwards. Who can blame them then? Hey, yo, man, you trying to rip us off? I got four bags missing here. That's the cut I got off Pablo. Don't like it? Take it up with him. I ain't dealing with Pablo. I'm dealing with you. That means you and me got a problem. You. Now, you asshole. You dirt-eating, no-good bastard son of a bitch. Stop right there. What? You, uh, got any real meat back there? You mean... Hey, honey? From animals? Oh, what are you doing? Don't here? be ridiculous. Sunshine. Shh. Shh. Don't walk in the What you got to eat? See for yourself. Somebody call the cops! Holy mother of God! Fuck! Yo, yo, ever try rainbow poppers? Purple haze? Got every color under the sun I do. Show me the range. Won't find a better mistake. Got anything that might interest me? Looking for, uh, something special. A brain dance to really... You mean, smut? Nah, more hardcore. Won't find it here. But there's a guy on Jig Jig Street. Has a whole lot of peculiar flicks. And I mean peculiar. Looking for, uh, something special. A brain dance to really... You mean, smut? Got anything that might interest me? Got something that'll keep you hard for hours. Well, well, who do I spy but V? 
in my humble parlor, no less. Bukako, long time no see. So what brings you here? How's things, Wako? This a prelude to whatever illegal favor you're about to ask me? What? <laughs> no, never. In that case, they couldn't be better. Kind of you to ask. And you? Looking for a brain dance. Oh, any particular one? Logo on the casing. A death's head moth. Whoa, now. That's quicksand. So I would advise caution. Know who makes them? Where they scroll them? And do you know what a fixer does? Allow me to explain. Not only do I finalize transactions, I can accomplish the goddamn impossible. Which would be... Making sure the buyer, supplier, and ever-neglected intermediary not only keep their heads in the games, but keep their heads, period. So don't you ever ask me who, with whom, where, when, why, or how. <laughs> Can you get me one of those recordings? No, but I have a pretty good idea who can. Who'd that be? There's a store on Jig Jig Street. It has a Pandora's box worth of crap inside. Try asking the owner. Thanks, Wako. Something that'll keep you hard for hours. Looking for, uh, something special. A brain dance to really... You mean smut? Nah, more hardcore. Won't find it here. But there's a guy on Jig Jig Street. Has a whole lot of peculiar flicks. And I mean peculiar. Come back some other time. Betting on it. How about you? You buying or just gonna stand there like a pig under cover? Looking for BDs. A particular kind. Particular? You a badge? Cops are like kids. Mommy and Daddy wouldn't let him go off in their lonesome. All right, all right. Can't be too careful. What do you want? Give me the best of the best. The ones with the death's head. <sighs> Didn't know I was dealing with a connoisseur. Death's head will cost you, though. Got anything that might interest me? Pleasure doing biz with you. What the 
hell's got you so amused? Oh, there's all some funny ass shit go downs off. Some juvies poured and fake IDs tried to sleep. Ah, sticky ne. And like it was nobody's bed. I told them to spin and delta, but they was tenacious. Made their way round back. Bathroom window. Fucked in through that. Yeah, I guess they were itchy and heat. I'd say so. <laughs> Are you from here? <laughs> yeah, I was born in this exact spot. Try to say. I mean, Night City. Maybe you and I go get something to eat after. <sighs> I'm from Des Moines, but this isn't a date. Hunt's off. Hop in. Let me get everything prepped. You make sure the wreath's snug on you. You'll watch while I edit in real time. The old one, too. Ready when you are. I want you to describe what you see. Might catch something at miss. 